Hi, hello, welcome back to me. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Hi, how you doing? Happy Thursday. I can't even be asked to piss about. How's your day been? <laughs> this is a regular thing, you know. Every day's a bit of a, you know, can't get my words out. But um, yeah, how you all doing? Hope you've had a good day so far. Well, it'll be evening now by the time you get this. Knowing me, it's probably about an half ten upload. I, yeah, sometimes upload very late because of just trying to like cram everything into the day you know with the kids and like school runs and you know doing stuff with them and now the new puppy and stuff um yeah i sometimes don't get time to like sit and like get all my videos sorted and that so yeah they end up out dead late but i do try and aim for like half seven half eight half nine ten at a push you know that's a bit of a gap really isn't it from what i said <laughs> but you know yeah i upload quite late but um yeah uh, oh my god verbal diarrhea start again Should I, yeah anyway we've had a good day anyway what have you been up to today i cheers go get a drink i've got lucas aid today <laughs> need a coffee though oh um <laughs> <sighs> i've got my music on as well i say this all the time as well it's just in case you can hear it in the background i like to have my music on low song of choice is well it's just what's playing high contrast remind me so yeah, sometimes I need like a certain type of playlist, you know, to get me going for the day. And that's one of them songs actually. But um, yeah, chatting shit again. Today I found a new shop. Well, it's not new, it's been there years, but I went in today for the first time and oh my God, I, I'm gonna be in there all the time. Amazing, honestly, I was in there about an hour. I could have spent way more money than I did, but I try and like restrict myself, you know, I'm trying to save for a house and stuff. So I am really trying to like, she says, <laughs> she says, you know, you know, I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying. All right. But there's just so many things in there that I could not like, you know, anyway, it's called bargain buys. This bag's a bit ever. It's called bargain buys. Anyone ever heard of it? That's what it looks like. Bargain buys. Um, it's in a place called Louth. So, pop to Louth today, which is in Lincolnshire, little little town, little, little village. Not quite sure what you call it, really. But, um, but yeah, I popped over today for something and it caught my attention. So I thought, you know what, I'll go and have a quick look. You know, here we are, 30 quid later. 30 quid, though, for four full bags. So, I think there's four, yeah, four bags. <laughs> Honestly, I'm going to be in there all the time. They, I've got amazing things in there they do have a short date some things do have a bit of a short date hence why they are a bit cheaper but you know in my house it comes in and it goes out honestly <laughs> so oh school <gasps> i don't know which school it is hang on it turns out it was primary school <laughs> everything's all right just a little follow-up on some like groups after school groups and stuff so yeah just to confirm a few things um yeah me not returning a slip for some things <laughs> i forget you know what we had a letter right which says um for anti-bullying week so which is amazing like they're highlighting the fact that bullying you know is not acceptable at all so it made me laugh because it said wear odd socks for the week or the day or something and i thought that's the norm <laughs> that's the norm in my house you, you look here if you find a match i even bought the kids a fresh pack the other day you would have seen in my poundland haul if you watched and they still like odd them up you know they don't even you know one had a grey one on and blue one on the other day and i was like what are you doing but anyway if you do like this video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and i shall get into it what was banging about this shop right is they sell everything from food to like christmas accessories they have all animal items they've got toys like christmas toys um everything absolutely everything so yeah i don't know i'll uh Bloody else, swallow your spit, girl. What I'm trying to say is I don't know if there's any of these anywhere else. I'm going to have to have a little Google. But, yeah, I'm not sure if I've spotted it before or I've just been totally, you know, oblivious to the fact that it's there. You know, just doing my thing. But the first thing I got for 59p is a pack of these Kellogg um, Special K like bars, you know, like the breakfast bars. So, yeah, you get five in there with two biscuits in. Strawberry flavoured, 59p. This, you're not going to be able to get your head around. <laughs> I was at the shop like, no, no way. A massive, massive, massive bottle of Blue Dragon dark soy sauce. £1.49 for a two litre bottle. Two litre. I use this a lot and it's like 55p, which is still quite cheap for a little one, a little. But, you know, got me two litre one, and I? I couldn't believe it. 
they've got all sorts in there. There's so many things in there as well that like I wouldn't have bought because like they're not me, but other people would think they're banging. Like they use them in their house. So honestly, if you have got one clothes, I didn't even know I had this. Like just Google bargain buys. And then some yellow mustard, Heinz, 39p. Come on, 39p. This, I don't even know what this is, but I just bought it. I've never heard of this in my life. Spelt, what's that? I ain't got a clue, spelt. It was 10p, 10p. So I was like, right, you're coming home. I love you 10p. So I think it's just like grains and stuff that you can like. Okay, tomato. they've got a recipe on the side. Tomato, basil and spelt risotto. So ready to serve, source of protein. Perfect for salads made with pulses, 10 pence. So I was like, right, I don't even know what you are, but we'll figure something out, okay? We'll work with it. Here are jelly beans. I've just seen 10 I was like, I'll just chuck them in. I've got, I think I've got three or four of these. So they are jelly bean sport beans, 10p each. I was walking around overly excited, creaming over absolutely everything. I, I was like, oh my God, oh my God, everything. It's just they're cheap. I got, oh here you are, look, another tin of that. Eager beaver, I don't even know what it is. And then ketchup. Says a quid, 29p. 29p, Mason goes through ketchup like you wouldn't believe. I don't care what it tastes like, as long as it's red and you can dip a chip in it, you know? Dijon mustard mayo, remember I was telling you the other day? 39p, 39p, Baxter's chilli jam, come on. 49p, Baxter's as well. I think Baxter's is a good, <laughs> I'm hyping it up, I think it's a good brand. You know, I shop a lot of low end stuff anyway, so. I think Baxter's is good. Um, and then four tins, well, cans of Iron Brew for a pound. It is the sugar-free one. I Honestly, I don't really like the sugar-free ones. I think they taste like shit, but I like Iron Brew, so it's the sacrifice I'm willing to make. I just, I prefer the flavour of, like, full sugar, to be honest. But four for a pound. Hang on, that mustard mayo, 29p. 29p. Not even 39, 29 can't get your head around it can you then i got this game for one of the kids i'm not sure who yet but i think they'll like this so it's a false alarm true or false game um with like the you know belly bit it's got a pen in there cards on the side if you shave your hair it'll grow back thicker than it was before true or false you know some sort of timer game 199 199 so my boys love games at Christmas, you know. One ninety nine family games as well. You know ones that you can all do. Sorry, I know I sound a bit overly excited. I am. That's why I am. Got crash a little toy. Look at his little teeth. He's so cute. He's so cute. Like I said, I will have a puppy update. But um, yeah, I'll do a video this week. But quid, quid, and then I got him a harness. Little little doggy harness. Little doggy harness, two ninety nine. It's a real strong one, you know. So yeah, we are gonna get him as he gets bigger, like a real like strong harness collar lead and all that, you know, because he is gonna be a big boy. But for now, like the lead we got from Poundland the other day is just for lead training, just so he's used to the lead. You know, we've been sitting down doing a lot of lead training with him. Um, which is getting better at. <laughs> he's still, you know, nipping it. Obviously, he's a puppy, you know. The one I got from Pound on the other day is just for that purpose only. So we need to get him a stronger one because, you know, he's going to get quite big. Um, but yeah, he's doing really well. Like, really well. Bicarbonate soda. Don't think I've ever had that in my life. 49p. 49p. It's in a really nice little tin as well. <laughs> I think this is really cute. 49p. And then I quite like soups and stuff. So... There is two of these somewhere for a pound. Two of these Baxter's current coriander soups. Um, yeah, they were two for a quid. Lloyd Grossman, two for a quid. Two for a quid. Lloyd Grossman's well expensive normally. Two for a pound. Steve likes a bit of the old Lloyd Grossman. And then more sauces, 29p each. So this is the Heinz curry mango. Sounds quite nice. Um, and the Heinz Korean style sticky barbecue sauce. 29p. Wagon wheels for the kids, 59p. 59p. And all of these for a pound. So five peanut butter Kit Kat chunkies for a pound. Just, I'm going to be in this shop all the time. 
all the time. And then I also got this, which is another present for Mason. So this lights up, it was 4 99 So price, yeah, just there, 4 99 It says on the back it includes a display stand. Amazing, my kids look like dinosaurs and stuff. You just, $4.99, 4 99 so I thought, yeah, I love you. And then, they sell my coffee. So I got some of my coffee, which is the NY coffee. And right, I got some of these, they were a quid. Right, I love these, as you know, I can eat these all day and night. That's not, I didn't have any, and I really fancied some, right? So Nip Tesco, and they're £1.69 from there. The heat coming from them was just too much. I couldn't take it. Six pints of milk and I'd probably down two pints of it. Like, it was shocking. Shockingly hot. Like, not even enjoyable. Like, just on the point of, like, what's the point? So, yeah, I suffered today. <laughs> Too much information here. She goes again. Yeah, I suffered today. But baby wipes quite cool in. <laughs> and then, they've got a load of, like, Jamie Oliver stuff. So, anything, two for a pound. So, they had a few of these different, like, pestos. So the one I got is the Broad Bean Mint and Pea Pesto. And then the Jamie Oliver Whole Wheat Pasta. So they're 59p each or two for a pound. So I thought, right, we'll have pasta one day this week. A bit of pesto pasta. And then I love these. So yeah, I got another one of these because the last one I had from Cherries is obviously gone now. They smell so good. They're so strong for a pound. They were a pound um so yeah that's that bag and then on to my last bag i got this game for one of the kids it is get a grip it's very heavy as well like it's not you know like some things that are cheap they can feel really lightweight and crap like you're pretty much just buying air that's what it feels like a box full of air whereas this feels like quite weighted like and it was 2.99 2.99 so it's the no thumbs challenge game and i think my kids will really like this like it's quite a fun thing that they would do so like it, you have loads of like different things that you've got to do but not using your thumbs so yeah like it says on the back there if you can see um you know a few bits and bobs about it but it just looks really fun like we'll all just have a laugh doing it um here's the other soup the other baxter soup two for a pound and um floor wipes 59p so 24 in there 59p and then a box of Kellogg cereal which was 69p so these are the zimmy ones yeah zimmy's chocolate dragon eggs so yeah tyler though he's been making himself um scrambled egg on toast and he really likes that responsibility of like just making his own scrambled egg and you know he does all like the chef's kiss and yeah he really like i have to hype him I'm like, oh my god that tastes so nice you know he's really been enjoying doing that um for breakfast in the morning and then i got some um black currant juice this was 59p or two for a pound but the reason i didn't get two is because i was trying to think of like carrying shit back to the car because it's quite a bit of a walk um and i just couldn't be off so and then another one of these for that price you know like yeah it's quite nice and the last two bits are a 39p bottle of fanta and a i don't know how much these biscuits were to be honest judging by everything else probably not that much but yeah they had like dr pepper as well which was 39p like these are the ones in the shop like it says on it one pound nine you know these are the ones in the shop that you know cost quite a bit so yeah i couldn't believe it when i walked in i was like right i was well in the element that is it that's everything i would highly recommend i mean i don't know where any are let me have a look bargain buys uk let's have a look so there's quite a few as you can see so many good bits in there honestly like go and have a little look especially for christmas like for the kids even like adults like gift sets and stuff like dead cheap but that's the end of the video i need to go get some petrol now because i'm on red I drove for miles on red i was like shit i'm gonna be that dickhead that fucking conks out i can see it so <laughs> i need to go get some petrol because it's stressing me out a bit you know one of them once it's out of my hour i'll be all right so yeah, I'm going to go get some petrol. As always, my friends, don't let any dickheads get you down ever, all right? Middle finger, that shit, okay? I say it all the time. It's so important. Do you know what? People are going to love you. People are going to hate you. People are going well, to... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean?
do you know what I mean? I'm chatting shit, I can't even get my own words out. People are gonna love you, people are gonna hate you, all right? People are always gonna chat shit about you, okay? Whatever you do in life, literally every single move you do, people are just gonna like comment, criticize and say what the hell they wanna say because you know, that's them and their, you know, insecure life. They're, they just like to chat shit and reflect, you know, put themselves on everyone else and it's just a load of shite, all right? They are a load of shite, okay? Don't listen to them. Like I said, middle, oh, blah, middle finger that shit all right you are so amazing all right it's none of your business what they think here let them do their thing let them judge let them chat shit all right you focus on you because you are amazing all right don't let them get you down okay and can i just say as well somebody said in the comments today that they tell their daughter um to not let any dickheads get them down every day and that's what i tell my kids and it made me feel really <sighs> I, I just i think that's amazing you know just don't let anyone get you down. People always try and like spurt their negativity on everyone else. But um, yeah, don't let the dickheads get you down. And they said that they needed t-shirts, they middle finger that shit. Well, my friends, watch this space, okay? May or may not be working on something. So <laughs> yeah, hope you're all right anyway. Fuck off, not you, me. Enjoy the rest of your evening, won't you? And I hope whatever you're doing, wherever you are in the world right now, you're having a great day or evening and I'll see you in my next video.